80% of the children with nephrotic syndrome can be treated with steroids which is the first line of therapy for childhood nephrotic syndrome. Hello, I am Dr. Shweta Priyadarshini and I am a consultant in pediatric nephrology with Apollo Hospital Jubilee Hills in Hyderabad. So a child with nephrotic syndrome presents with edema or swelling of the entire body. It typically starts as swelling around the eyes which is more prominent early in the morning and then it goes to involve the entire body. Child will simultaneously have oliguria that is decreased urine output and as the oliguria and, uh, progresses the edema will also progress. Now the, this is not a very good sight for the parents to behold the child swollen up so much but then what has to be kept in mind that this is a treatable disease 80% of these children they respond very well to steroids and later on in life they will not have any residual renal problems the child can lead a normal adult life free of any renal disease provided the care by the pe uh, pediatric nephrologist is done appropriately and the parents follow up appropriately with the pediatric nephrologist. So a child with nephrotic syndrome should be allowed to lead a normal life. He should go to schools, should participate in sports, should pass participate in all, all co-curricular activities. He should be allowed to do that. Only thing that there are certain things to be kept in mind and this, this will be told to you by a pediatric nephrologist if you take a child to the, uh, to the pediatric nephrologist with nephrotic syndrome is that the child should not be given immunizations, you know, especially the live immunizations, live vaccines around when he has this, uh, when he is on steroids. Then also the child should, you know, we should try to prevent infections as much as possible. So basically the care has to be taken by a pediatric nephrologist. The dose of steroids has to be given by a pediatric nephrologist because steroid can potentially hamper the growth of the child. So we have to take care to give only as much steroids as would be required to control the disease and not let the side effects manifest as much. If your child has edema, that is swelling of the body, of the face or the child has less urine output, you should take the child to the pediatric nephrologist.